weather is complex. It's inherently chaotic and unpredictable. Numerical weather prediction is probably one of the greatest achievements of the 20th century in the physical sciences. The ability for us to take observations and combine them with rules that govern how the atmosphere as a fluid work and then produce actionable forecasts, I think is incredible. What I love about ballooning is how subtle it is and how much attention you have to pay to the weather. Definitely, we have much more weather information available than we've ever had before and we can make much better predictions and that allows us to fly better and more accurately and most importantly, more safely. The most rounded forecasts that we can offer for these types of events. We get here super early. We leave at 4.30 in the morning to get here, and we have pilot briefing at 6 a.m. So, although they give us a weather briefing here, I've looked at the weather uh, myself, and it's actually really, really setting up to be beautiful. Calmish winds, light and variable, not quite as cold as I would like. Um, that's the only drawback. The colder it is, the better we fly, basically. Usually by nine. So here's kind of what we've got going on across the area. We've got that high pressure to our north. The clockwise flow around that high is going to lead to that southerly flow, especially aloft.